Welcome to a preview of the Quaddy this Saturday night at headquarters. Races 5, 6, 7 and 8 are the Quaddy legs at Cannington. And the first leg is an association stake, a city grade four race over 642 metres. This race is an absolute ripper with B Tops, Tapalin, You Know Dylan, Zoo Rebel, Mantra Miss, and Son of Pensk all to go head to head. Let's have a look at the early speed chart. Mantra Miss has plenty of speed in seven. Tapalin showed plenty of dash at Mandra last Friday. You Know Dylan's another one with speed. But according to Frisbee's early speed chart, it's quite even. Possibly number five punch drunk to settle well back in the early stages. To the probability, this will be interesting. B tops, tapple in, both given a chance. You know Dylan with 18. And there's Mantra Miss with 24 and Son of Pensk with 18. So plenty of chances in the first leg. Moving on to race six, it's the West Chase final. The stake money here is sensational. 18,000 in total for this race. And Benno does look very hard to beat. Best of times, looms is a danger. But having a look at the early speed, and I think this is where the race is going to be won because Benno has a huge skyscraper there. The blue skyscraper towering over the others. He should lead. He should win. He should have no problems in collecting. Best of times will be charging home. Sandy Lander showed early speed and Countess of Cork was a great run in its heat. To the probability and Benno, there'll be a huge slice of blue pie here surely. Sandy Lander, 7% chance of winning. Benno with 52 so if you get even money, you'll be doing very well according to Frisbee ratings best of times is on the second tier with an 18% chance but that's a huge piece of blueberry pie moving on to race seven and we've got Amatol who will appreciate box one ruffles showed speed last start black range and purple range both hard to beat care label looks to have a chance as well to the early speed columns and there's a big one for ruffles in five a big yellow column uh, Night Bomber might be up there early, along with number two, Lamington. To the probability ratings, Black Range, 21, the highest rating. Purple Range with 19, still searching for a win in WA though, Purple Range. Amatol off the good draw on the third line with a rating of 17. To the final leg of the quaddy, Ben Copper loves box one. He has been out of form, but he might improve. Honix Pride's a very quick beginner with a great record in this grade. Micro Miss continues to get better. Ankatel Bob pipped on the post last Saturday. And Master Shamby ran a great race at Northam on Monday. To the early speed, and there'll be a big black and white tower here. There it is for Tonic's Pride. Shouldn't have any problems crossing Bent Copper. And according to those columns, is a massive chance to hold the lead. Although Micro Miss may challenge with Ankatel Bob, Bertie Sinet, and Master Shamby. He's going to have to fly out of the boxes to get across into a prominent position. To the probability percentages, Bent Copper to improve, 13% chance of winning according to uh, Frisbee. Tonics Pride with 28, Micro Miss 19, Master Shamby given a chance, 17. Now to the quaddies. We'll have a look at my one first. In the first leg, I've gone numbers one, two, three, seven, and eight. Plenty of chances, just happy to be alive after the first leg. In the second leg, Benno and Best of Times. I want Best of Times in there as well because if something goes wrong, with Benno, best of times is clearly better than the others, in my opinion. In the third leg, numbers three, six, and eight, Care Label, Black Range, Purple Range, and in the final leg, numbers two, five, and eight, Tonics Pride, Micro Miss, and Master Shamby. Now to Frisbee's Quaddy selection, and just before we look at that, mine will cost $45 for the 50 cent unit. Now to Frisbee's Quaddy selection. First leg, numbers one, two, three, seven, and eight. Second leg, number four, Benno, all by himself. He has to win. In the third leg, numbers one, three, four, six, and eight. And in the final leg, numbers one, two, five, and eight. Frisbee including Bent Copper in his quaddy. That'll cost $40 for the 50 cent unit. Have a great weekend and good luck if you're playing the quaddy at Cannington this Saturday night.